So we've got a new event in Islands, and it's an Obby Mushroom mini game. So if you go ahead and go into the hub, you should go to this info board right here, and you should be able to search a game. Now before you do that, you want to actually go ahead and queue up with the party. Alright, so once you load in, you want to actually head all the way over this bridge right here, and head to this little, like, archway looking thing. Then you're actually going to parkour all the way over to the next island. Now as you can see, you actually need to use your pickaxe down in the number 2 slot, and actually go ahead and mine 16 copper ore. And you're actually going to be racing against four other people. And the best strategy I have right now is to go ahead, be in one area. As you can see, I'm getting so much by just being in this little area. Now, what you're going to go ahead and do is you should see this obby where you came from. And you should see this green massive portal. Now, it'll be red, but once you've actually gone ahead and got that 16 copper, you should be able to go through and it'll turn green. Now, once you've actually walked all the way through, just keep following it until you find this next obby. Now, do this this obby until you get to that next island. Alright, so once you're at this next island, you're going to need to harvest only glowing mushrooms. Now, a little bit of people get confused by it saying only glowing mushrooms. Now, a lot of people think you just, it's really bad to harvest these, but it's actually not bad to harvest the non-glowing ones, because it just makes it so more of the glowing ones can spawn. And now I've just gone ahead and got 15 of them, and now I can go to the next portal right here. So now once you've actually gone ahead and got to this island, you're going to defeat 10 of these mushroom gullies. Now these things are quite easy to kill, they don't do much damage to you, but you do quite a fair bit of damage with your diamond greatsword. Alright, so now once I've actually completely killed all them, and now I can actually go through this green portal and go to the next island. Now for this island, you're gonna go ahead and pull out your net. Now you should be able to find little snails on the ground. Now use your net to go ahead and catch them like spirits. Now they're really small, so you have to be quite precise to actually go ahead and catch them, but you only need to catch 15 of them. And now we need this last one, and then we can go to the next island. And then, now you're gonna pull out your fishing rod. Now for this one, you can go ahead and fish here, or you can go ahead and just go straight over to this bridge and fish off the bridge, what in my opinion is better since you're closer to the actual portal right there. Now for this one, you actually have to go ahead and catch three carps, and there's our last one. Now we can go ahead and go through here, and this is the last island. So go ahead and just do this little parkour, jump down here, and now you wanna climb this hill. So now, once you've actually climbed this hill, a lot of people actually think you have to go ahead and do this obby right here. And that is not the case. The button is just right here, located in the middle of the hill. Now, if you go ahead and press it, it will go ahead and say in chat that I have won. Now, you see that it says Team 2, and it doesn't say my name. Well, if you hold tab, there's a leaderboard to see who's on what team, and etc. And it can show you how much score points you have, and stuff like that. Now, the top three people will get more points than anyone else and anyone else from lower than top three will get just the same amount of points what I'm pretty sure is 45 so what I've heard is that first is 75 second is 65 and third is 55 and then any other place from third is 45 tickets and even if you lose with the timer at the top of the screen you will get 45 tickets and I got 75 mushroom obby tickets and I got some glowing mushrooms now what can you actually do with these tickets what I've just one out of the game mode. Well, right next to the info board, you can actually talk to Obby host Jim, and you can actually go ahead and click redeem tickets and actually get a bunch of cool items. And then you can get the Nature's Divine Longbow, you can get the arrows with it, and you can get the Divine Dow and the Mushroom Event 2023 trophy. Now, I'm going to go ahead and buy one of each of these glowing blocks, and I'm actually going to go back to my island and see if they glow. Alright, so I'm back on my island, I'm going to go ahead and place these all, and yeah, it does look like they do glow, so that is cool. Now, what I've heard is you can actually go ahead and place the mushrooms as well, and they glow quite well. Oh, wow. <laughs> And now they've gone ahead and added in a new fish, and this fish is the Koi fish. So, it looks like this. So, if I go free cam, it kind of looks, uh, very goofy, in my opinion. And now, apparently, this fish is a legendary fish we can go ahead and get in just the hub when you're actually fishing. But you can't actually go ahead and sell that fish, so yeah, I don't know. Now we're gonna see how easy it is to actually get it. So, all of us are gonna just fish, and the first person to get it, just shout yay. Oh, this person got one, yay! <laughs> Look at him, he just got one. 
So it's not too hard to actually get it, but it is a little hard because I didn't get it, but yeah. But yeah, if you want to go ahead and help me out in future videos, join my Discord server because this is where I got everyone to join me right now. So going back into Jim the host, you can actually see that everything's trade locked and this is actually going to become untrade locked when the event is over. Now this event can last up to two weeks or a month, so just get grinding because it could go away in two weeks or a month. Now that's pretty much it in this update, now click on this video right up here to win free items.